Where's the outrage that somebody in the federal government took it upon themselves to illegally and unethically release information about private citizens that they were, uh, by law, required to keep silent and secret? This is very troubling. Hey, Governor, and I yes, want to an investigation needs to happen. On your second point right there, which is the fact that Chairman Nunes says basically that his source or sources are telling him that there was some sort of a list of which Trump associates got swept up in this. That key point, there may have been legitimate surveillance of people overseas and then U.S. citizens here like General Flynn could have gotten swept up in that. But more importantly, there was a list somewhere that Obama administration officials saw and instead of having the names masked as it's supposed to be, the names in some cases were right out there and then circulated allegedly by Obama officials. This sounds completely wrong and unethical. Let's go a step further. It's criminal. It's criminal, Ed. You can't do that. You cannot potentially take, inf or take information that is secret by law and disseminate it and leak it and give it and unmask it. And in some cases, what the chairman said was that even some things that were masked were so clearly uh, identifiable uh, that a five-year-old putting a puzzle together could have hmm. figured out who they were talking about. So that, to me, is the more troubling part of this than anything else, and it's got to be brought to ground and investigated. But, Ed, I don't think a congressional investigation will work because it's going to be partisan. Mm -hmm. uh, both sides will accuse the other of not being fair. It's going to require an independent type of investigation because long gone are the days of the Sam Irwins and the uh, Howard Bakers of the world sure. who on a bipartisan basis could look for truth. Governor, newsworthy that you as a Republican are now saying there should be an independent probe of this whole Russia situation, the surveillance, but how do you get politics out of it? Who's appointed to do this? No matter who's picked, it seems like the Democrats are going to score their points, Republicans are going to score their points, and there's going to be a lot more heat and not a lot of light. And that's a real problem because people like James Comey, I think, have compromised what would have been uh, much more confidence in some of our federal agencies and the people who work there. I, I think you're going to have to find some people who are, and this is going to be hard to find, people who are, are above reproach, and it may be the longest search in American history to find them. <laughs> They're going to have to go beyond Washington to find that, Governor. Maybe, well, it may be easier to find Jimmy Hoffa than it will be to find these people who can do this. 